one of the most difficult components uh, in doing a disc brake conversion kit is, is determining whether or not it's going to fit within your wheels. Uh, back in the 50s, 60s, a lot of the wheels were 14 inch and then progressed forward to 15 inch. Uh, either way, they can both be challenging in fitting uh, disc brake uh, rotor and calipers within the wheel. So because of the technology that's available to us today, we are able to create and build kits uh, within SolidWorks, which gives us the opportunity to create a wheel template. Uh, this wheel template simply prints out on a piece of paper, but then from there we can actually take it and put it within the wheel to determine fitment. To find the templates, these are all on our product pages on our website. You'll see a portion up in the corner that says wheel template. Uh, print that out. Once you've printed it out, simply take a ruler, use the guide on here to make sure that you've printed it to scale uh, on that template. From there, you're going to cut this out, place it on a manila folder just to keep it sturdy. And from there, you simply just put it inside the wheel. To start the process, simply take a tape measure and measure the inside opening of the wheel. This will go anywhere from 2500 to 3100 based on the wheel opening. And you'll also notice that that is actually on the template as well. You wanna make this as close as possible because this will center the template within the wheel to determine proper fitment. Once you have everything uh, determined as far as the center of the wheel, you're gonna wanna have something like this. You've got the center hub measured here. This will be your rotor mounting surface. And then out here is the actual outside profile of the caliper. And this is what we're gonna actually wanna look at when placing it inside the wheel to make sure that it clears all surfaces uh, of the inside of the wheel. So simply take it inside hub register, and then that'll go inside the wheel and you determine basically at that point whether or not the disc brake conversion kit is going to fit your wheels. So once you've uh, finished kind of placing the template inside the wheel, at this point you'll know whether or not things are going to fit or they're not gonna fit. Uh, if they don't fit, you do still have maybe a couple of options. Obviously the most obvious is, is change wheels. Uh, sometimes that's not always a choice that we wanna look at. So the other option maybe becomes look at a, a wheel spacer uh, to move uh, the wheel out away from the brakes. Um, this can be done by simply just putting a couple of spacers between this template and the wheel and just kind of use that as a guide to how thick you might need things. Uh, if you've got questions in that or you know, need some additional assistance, give one of our sales representatives a call. We're always here to help. Uh, you can always check our website at mpbrakes.com uh, for any additional information.